so hi everyone so today i'm trying to show you that uh, how to configure uh, metadata in dynatrix uh, custom metadata like uh, suppose uh, suppose you have installed dynatrix one agent on your uh, on your host and you are not aware that in that host uh, what are the applications are installed what are the services are running and who is the application owner who is the application owner so in that like uh, what we'll do is in dynatrix uh, will configure uh, environment custom metadata so we will come to know that like uh, in which host uh, there suppose you have l1 team l1 l2 team so we will come to know that like uh, this host belongs to the application owner in that host what are the service are running so we will come to know that so so i am trying to configure and uh, i'll try to show you that the first step is uh, i'm trying to configure trying to log in aws also So we are going to sign in to AWS console. Then uh, let me log in. Let me log into run it as SaaS portal as well. So we have logged into Dynatrix SaaS portal. Now I'm going to deploy Dynatrix one agents. So let me spin up one VM on the on AWS. So what we will do is we go back. And we have only ten. Let me just up. Let's start the game. Oh no, it did not work. Let me launch it again.
taking uh, all traffic source from anywhere. Here we go. Launch. I'm trying to download nuclear. Host group. Download the host KPI. Yeah, downloaded. Let me launch the system. Now it is was launch. I'm trying to now action. So VM is up now. What I'll do is I'll click on this VM. Now I'll copy this IP. Already we have logged into Novaxtra. So I'll go to the session. Take SSS. And control V. SSS is for Red Hat and default is Germany. DC2 user. And I'll go to advanced setting and upload the same type. So I'm able to log in now. So I'm going to root here. And root here. This is the password. And then so it's a press VM. So you need to install the aggregate command. And then it's an aggregate over here. So now WGET installs and now I'm trying to deploy Dynamics one agent. Reload, so start this position. I'm going to change this command. Reload. It will take a few minutes to install and the phone again. So Dynet has been successfully installed. So we will go to Dynet portal and we'll see the deployment status. So yeah, so Dynet is already installed. So we'll go inside in that. So here we have properties and tab. Okay. Now here I want to add some 
custom metadata it will take in our application name then application owner name so these are the details we'll get it so what are the required so belong to which bo and also what we'll do is now what i'll do cd class that class this class and this is directly ls so this class directly now i'm going to run it as folder then cd and then ls again cd one again ls so cd again now ls cd config now in the ls so we have this this many files so what i'll do is create one file va custom properties dot com file so what i do is go to home and take the matrix data data and tab folder So I will create uh, custom properties of function. So copy this and go to VA and create this folder. Now I will add this feature. So like uh, so we have Java app name. So these are the details I have to copy it. Search mode and paste. So here I have given that the app name as well as per the my requirement. What I do is app name is equal to whatever the application name you have, you can give the application name is B. Environment is just organization is BOT, owner is equal to There is issue and I'm going to do something. So I'll uh, go escape colon wc exclamation mark. Now so we have added this uh, host custom properties of com file. Now what I will do is for reflecting this uh, configuration file, what I have to do is we have to restart one agent server. The command is stop. One minute. Yeah. We'll wait another uh, one minute. So no, we we'll stop. We'll check the status. Status now. Status. So it is one agent service is stored in access. Now what I'll try to do is I have to start this. One minute is this. Now I have to check the game is starting. So it's not running. So we have one start we started the dynamics one agent service. Now I will go to the portal and see. Under the host tab, another custom metadata is reflected. Let me refresh it and 
days of winter time for Kolkata first settlement. Take hardly to take five years to get five years. Now it is showing one agent setting to be stop for one minute. So now it is see, we can see what the environment, environment custom of the app name is going to be set as a DPI, environment is going to be done, organization is going to be the owner, and the application owner, so what are the services are running over here. So if anything goes down related to this host, uh, that L1 team is executing, they can directly refer to me. Like uh, if it, and this has any critical issues happening. And if the support is required, they are working. You can use your support details. Thank you.